Okay, here's the deal. The last year I've been really getting into handguns, so okay. uh, you've always told me how proficient you know, that you had needed to become with your military career, and I've always mm -hmm. been kind of intrigued by that because I try to relate that to what we do out in the blind when geese are coming in. Mm -hmm. So today I just kind of wanted to come out with some of these do-all targets and, and, and just kind of get some, uh, I guess, can general direction from you on what you learned. Uh, to start off, really, I mean, we're just going to go over the very basics. A lot of times you don't have the... Um, the time or the position to have the perfect stance. So always, the way I, I break it down is, is have a good grip, and what that does is it's gonna give you um, a consistent shot every time. So after you take your first shot, if you have a good grip, your follow-up shots are gonna be better. Okay. Another thing is sight picture, sign alignment, and trigger squeeze. I brought a 1911 45 caliber okay. for you. I'm gonna shoot a little nine millimeter. So the reason I'm shooting this gun right here is that I feel that it's, it fits me well as far as a concealed mm -hmm. gun. And, and, and your pistol grip, I didn't see anything wrong with it. Um, you did, um, one thing I'd, I'd, I'd point out that, that was very good is you had a nice high, high grip on the pistol. Okay, um, a lot of times I see a lot of uh, be beginning pistol shooters, they'll hold the gun like this, and when, when they do that, I mean, I'm, I'm exaggerating this a little bit, but obviously it's going to exaggerate the recoil in the pistol. So you want a nice high grip, and, that's, and, you, and you had that. And you also did a really good job of locking in your, or your shooting hand with your support hand. Perfect. So that, that's also very important. Both, uh, both thumbs were forward. So your fundamentals right off the bat, very, very good. I can't really say anything bad okay. about it. To the right. Missing at every shot. You hit the first one. That was low. That was high and right. Okay, so looking looking at you shooting, um, I identified right off the bat um, your your uh, support thumb was kind of coming off, so you didn't have that tight grip. And like I said before, whenever you have that tight grip, it's really good for for follow up shots. As you know. You hit the first one, and then every shot after that, it was was a miss. Yeah. So, looking at your shots, is there's um, there's not a, an indication that it's one thing or the other because it's kind of a little bit all over, which would lead me to believe that it's possibly a sight picture or sight alignment. Okay. So when I say sight picture, um, it, it's a three dot sight system. So you want you want to make sure that the three dots are all in a row, and that the top of the front sight is even with the top of the rear sight. So if you have that, then no no matter where you put that sight picture it's going to hit there okay okay does that does that make sense 100 percent 